Hello, everybody. Uh, my name is Willie Ramsdale, and I'm doing my demonstration speech for you guys today. And my topic for my demonstration speech is how to build every six-year-old and my favorite quick snack or lunch item, and that is a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. The first thing to do, the most important thing, obviously, is to get all of your ingredients. In this case, there are three for the food. You have your bread, your peanut butter, and your jelly. And for this sandwich, I'm doing creamy and strawberry. Obviously, there's plenty of options out there, crunchy peanut butter and all kinds of jams and jellies. Also, you need to get two things. You need to get a plate to work on and a knife. Butter knife, preferably. That way, it's not sharp and you don't cut the bread. So, the way I do it is I pick one side of the bread and I take the peanut butter and you get however much peanut butter you want to put on the sandwich. Uh, for me in particular, I like to put more peanut butter than jelly. <clears throat> so I'll take the one side and place the peanut butter on the one half and spread it nice evenly over the bread. Just like that. There you go. Got it all covered. Got a nice layer of peanut butter on there. And that's important to swipe the knife on the edge of the peanut butter jar just to get all that excess peanut butter off. <coughs> that way it doesn't get make its way into the jelly jar. So then I get <coughs> my jelly, which is Smucker's. And I put some of it on the other side. Like so. And spread it on the bread. Having the plates good because you can maneuver a little bit more. And then once you get that spread, you can wipe the jelly off onto the jelly jar. Put the lid back on that. And now the easy part. Take the two sides, flip them together, and you have yourself one delicious peanut butter and jelly sandwich.